Hello, babies. Hello. Hi there. Okay, guys, we got something really special planned out for you today. Um, with us, we have uh, none other than the legendary voice actor and impressionist, uh, Bo Snowtree. Yeah. Uh, Snowtree, uh, thank you so much for coming. Uh, it's great to be here. Thank you. <laughs> we, we were dying. Uh, we, were, we were laughing our asses off because he actually does a really great impression. Uh, of... I actually care about trying to go get those lives. <laughs> and I remember there was a way to get them, but... You're being, Jess, you're being rude to our guest, okay? Bo actually does yeah. a really mean impression of me. Like, he can... <laughs> he can... What's it called? Uh, Bo, can you, can you do your impression of me? <clears throat> Hi, I'm Rob. <laughs> You're so stupid. Doesn't that sound just like me? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. god. Uh, hey, that's hey, crazy. Hey, Bo, how about you do the rest of your uh, appearance on this episode in my voice? Uh, I I'd be happy to do that. <laughs> I hate you so much. This is awesome. You're so stupid. I'm so glad we. <laughs> Jess, are you talking to me or are you talking to our guest here, Bo Snowtree? Both of them. <laughs> Jess, it's funny because Bo said it that time. And Bo, more like Bozo. <laughs> Sorry, that was bad. That was mean. Also bad. I, 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 uh, Jess, if you keep treating our guest like that, he might just get up and and uh, and and break your favorite coffee mug. For those of you really? who can't, if you can't tell at home, that's oh, Bo he talking. Oh, doesn't do it anymore? Oh, back when the old game, if you, like, left them well enough alone, they'd run off the cliff. It was funny as hell to watch. Well, I had to change that, because that's not very, um, progressive. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You know what I could go for? I could go for some frozen, um, frozen peas. Like, I don't even like to heat them Frozen up. Frozen peas? I just like to eat them cold. That's disgusting. Yeah, I know. I'm... I'm, I'm God, I'm stuck. I'm Rob 80. I like frozen peas. I'm disgusting. I oh, guess Bo. you're Bo. Bozo. <laughs> oh, my God. Bo, you're gonna... You're gonna try... I don't... Okay, anyone listening, if, if it sounds like I'm saying anything wacky, just know that that's Bo, okay? Oh my god, God, Bo is so silly. I love him. I love you too, Rob. You're stupid. <laughs> uh. Do they have giant spoons? It looks like their weapon is a giant spoon. At least they're not a bowl of cereal. You know, I once ate a whole toilet bowl sized bowl of cereal once. I eat that for breakfast most so days. So, are we using toilet bowls as, like, a means of measurement now? Is that what you're telling me? It was just the first thing that came to mind when I thought of the size of this, uh, bowl. I mean, I guess a punch bowl would have been a pretty accurate description. Okay. Well, just saying, is when I went on the toilet bowl later that day, I felt like I got punched. Haha. -ha. Mm-hmm. Hilarious. You know, you're being kind of rude to our guest right now, Jess. I ought to I ought to reach right over there and I ought to just bop you on the head. Are you Bo or Rob? Who do you think is talking right now? Rob would never speak to you like that. <laughs> I'm just going to go over there and I'm going to I'm going to take a hammer and I'm going to treat you like a field mouse and like I'm and little bop you on, bop me on the head. Bop you on the head exactly. You're going to get bopped, girl. And you see, the domestic uh, violence is funny, because I'm using a comical term for it. <laughs> Wham! <laughs> Bat! Uh -huh. so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I tell you one thing, he should watch his back. Damn, Rambo. Yeah, where you... Like, oh. he had a knife and everything, he's like, oh, he'd better watch his fucking back. And then he proceeds to do nothing. Yeah. He's gonna... Oh, that was his way of telling you that you need to flame his butt. Uh. You could just be right. You could be to the point be like, you know. Yeah, one would think, right? You know. Burn his butthole. Ugh! Yep. 
You're singeing his poor little ass hairs. Speaking it of used to be much funnier in the old game because it was like this flat orange ass. But now they made it too real. Yeah, they, they didn't want it to uh, <laughs> make a flat orange ass because they didn't want people thinking of the like, United States president. Dr. Shemp is thick. Oh, uh, like, you, like you just want to like bend him over and play it like the bongos. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Follow me, y'all. I'm Bo Snowtree. Professional uh, impersonist. You want to know how good of an impressionist I am? I've been doing this show completely by myself, like, this whole time. Jess yeah. See? I, I do a pretty mean Jess impersonation, don't I? She's not even here. It's like I remember him running in a circle. I guess this is one of the things they changed. I even talk off topic like Jess does. I got this character down. Oh, no, no, no. I got my Kingdom Hearts and Spiral Controls mixed up. <laughs> <laughs> Are you getting all the gems, Jess? Yeah. Are you sure? You're not gonna miss any? I might. <laughs> we'll find out. I never realized before, Jess, but that enemy kinda looks Motherfucker. like you. Motherfucker. What did you just say? Ah, eh, never mind. It's funny that it's like you beat Dr. Shemp, but this is the last bitch of the level that you actually beat. Mm -hmm. She's just looking at you just like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? <laughs> and you did it! You succeeded for on your first try for once. Bite me. <laughs> I could go for a glass of milk, that'd be awesome. I could go for some Tostito rolls. You wanna go make us some? Ah, you know what? Um, uh, I guess, uh, where's your kitchen? It's okay, Bo, I'll make the Tostino rolls. You just chill. Well, actually, I'm um, looking at the time. I actually have to get going, so let me just uh, do some uh, plugging real fast before I go. Uh, my name is uh, Bo Snowtree. You can follow me on like all forms of social media. Uh, I'm doing a... Um, I'm going to be uh, working on an animated short for the series Dougie Makes a Fart, so um, I'd say definitely uh, check that out. Um, I'm also going to be working, uh, I'm going to be doing some uh, voiceover work for the... Did uh, I do all the levels in this game? I for, mean in this level? For the film uh, yeah, White I Chicks did, 2, right? uh, A Cancun Caper, I'm going to be doing a, uh, some voice work for that as well. So uh, please, yeah, you know, yeah. follow me, uh, see those projects. Um, um, all right, I'm out. Thank you guys for having me. It was so much fun to be here. Bye, Bozo. <laughs> oh, Bo, I love you. you found so, much stolen treasure. so are you going to make me some pizza rolls? <laughs> it was kind of weird that he did my voice the entire time, right? Like, I told him to do it, but I didn't think he actually would. He is talented, though. Like, I think I th I think he kind of sounds like he me. He didn't even bother, like, trying to open a door or something. It's just like, bye! What are you talking about? He's like, he poofed. You mean he quietly walked out of our studio? <laughs> like... Yeah. I'm sorry. Hey, Bo, can you slam the door? Crafter's world, if you're ready. You know what? Uh, I'm sure that the uh, our editor will just add in a door sound effect. There we go. You okay. happy now? I am the editor. <laughs> <laughs> We're entering the Magic Crafter world. And we're gonna jump on into. Oh, yeah, make a fire. Shoot the fire. Won't let me. Oh, that's so lame. <coughs> 3,000. That's a lot of freaking gems. 3,000 is a lot of anything if you think about it. Yeah. Like, what's it. Like, what's a. Well, what is under 3,000 that's only a little bit? Like, rice, maybe? Or, like, sand? Molecules. Yeah. That's not something you collect, but I, I agree. Alright, next time on, uh, next time, babies. Bye.